Alright, welcome back to my Pokemon Black walkthrough. Um, there we go. And you'll notice that I'm not in Castello City anymore. I'm actually in Route 4, which is just <coughs> above it. And we're actually going to catch our next Pokemon here. So, yeah. We're just going to see this item. It's an X accuracy. You can take that if you want. See if this is it. Oh, it is. That's right. We're going to be catching a sand dial. Now, sand dial are useful. Like they don't have the greatest. Like they're a dark and ground type. They don't have the greatest defenses, so they have really good attack power. And they can't, and they can get really good speed too. So, there we go. Now we're gonna throw a pokeball at it, which is a regular pokeball. I don't think I need to use a great ball or anything. Oh, that's a bastard. Okay, I'm gonna actually try something else now. Let's see. I'm gonna try a great ball. Might as well. There we go. And yeah, we caught our third Pokemon. Now we'll just read you the Pokedex entry. Sandal, the Desert Croc Pokemon. It is 2 feet and 4 inches. It weighs 33.5 pounds. And the entry is, they live buried in the sands of the desert. Some warm sands prevent their body temperature from dropping. So we're going to nickname him... Hunter. Alrighty, so I'm just gonna cut back to the Pokemon Center and we'll be right back. Okay, so I thought I should show you this. On the, my way back to the Pokemon Center, I just tried to go down some random alleyway and then this guy shows up and he's like, where did I put those sunglasses? Then he comes out and he just tells you something. Then he gets you the TM70 Flash, which will come in handy later when you try to get through this cave. Not in the main story, though. You never have to use it in the main story. So, yeah. Anyway, I might as well just start recording from here, so this is Pokemon Center. I'm just going to go inside there and heal up quickly, so I'll be right back. Okay, here we are, back again, and now I'm going to show you around the city. First of all, I want to show you up here. Now, if you have an event Celebi from, um, what do you call it, uh, Heart Gold and Soul Silver, you can actually get this little thing called a transfer machine. It's a building up here, I'm not going to show it to you, oh, fuck. Um, actually I might as well know. It's this building right here. There's a guy with a Pikachu inside. You go up the elevator and you talk to the scientist. And you give him the phrases, everyone happy and simple connection. And he will give you a transfer machine. In which you can get Celebi and go to a guy over here. And, oh, yeah, this alleyway. And you just search the buildings, you can find them easy. Um, in the Game Freak building, talk to him after you have the Celebi, and he'll give you a Zorua. So, if you want Zorua, that's how you get it. Anyway, I'm just gonna go down here first, and show you the gym. 
but once you try and go into the gym, you'll see that Bert, or uh, Sharon comes out, and he says he beat Jim Way the Bird. Fad. So good day, Sharon. And then you, um, and then you don't even get a chance to move in, and the fad comes out, and he's like, yeah, well, Team Plasma stole someone's Pokemon, so. Yeah, I guess that's where we're going. And it's over here. I think it's this one. Anyway, first of all, I'm actually going to give Sandile the EXP share, because he's low on level. Nope, why is it down here? And it's one over down here. No, it's one of the ones over here. I believe it's this one. Yep. Okay, so you see that there's Bianca, some little black girl, and Fag. And then, apparently, Team Plasma stole Bianca's Pokemon. It's like, oh. Alright. I'm basically just sitting and talking about how they could find it, and then all of a sudden the retard comes back to see me the crime like an idiot. And he just takes chaining. And then they keep talking and won't let me leave. So you go over here. And it's really easy to find them. They just go right back to the uh, gym leader building. And Bird says they went that way, so yeah. Just come here, and then you'll see that there's three Team Plasma guys sitting out front the door here. We fucking run. I'm gonna teach you a lesson, boy. A lesson in pain. Like, the pain your father did when he abused you as a child. To the pain has me grunt. Okay, now I'll look for half of the guy's dark type. I always forget to find out the dark type. And I always forget the psychic psychic type moves don't work against dark types. Always forget about that. Oh. Anyway, so I think yeah, this guy just has a bunch of sound eyes, so This is a cutter. And yeah, not too hard at all. And he's like, oh, it's bad. Something but seven stages, and then he runs inside. And then the crazy black chip chains in there with Bianca. And then I'm left to do what I want, but I'm gonna go in here. Might as well do what the rest of them are doing. And you see Yeats is there. And then he says it would be, he thought it was amusing to make a hideout beside the Pokemon Center. I mean, the Pokemon Gym. He's talking about the dragon type Pokemon and how their lord will become the Fira. He always stutters I and Team Plasma. It's like, how can anyone not like notice that? He's just the most evilest freaking guy ever. He's an asshole, pretty much. Shut up, guys. And 
the answers, I don't know that. No, some of these disappear. We, I guess we just let them walk right out the door. you a yacht bay. I forget what a yacht bay does. And then you go over here and you find a smoke ball. Don't go up there, there's nothing there. And yeah. On the next episode of Pokemon Black, we will challenge the gym.